in this module we shall continue with some practical issues in profit sharing investment accounts in the previous segment or module we answered question number one which was is it permissible to open a profit sharing investment account with a conventional bank and question number two for this module is is it permissible for a bank islamic or otherwise to change the profit sharing ratio unilaterally we shall attempt to answer this question in this module so the question is it permissible for a bank whether this is islamic or conventional to change the profit sharing ratio unilaterally let us answer this question systematically we have been stating in the context of mudaraba that a profit distribution ratio should be agreed between the rabbul mal ie the party providing capital and the other party doing the business and once this profit distribution ratio has been agreed between the two parties it cannot be changed unilaterally so the question is about this bank which is actually a mudarib can the mudarib change the profit distribution ratio unilaterally once it has already been announced and agreed by all the parties concerned now the word unilaterally is uh, very important of course unilaterally by one party without getting the consent of the other party profit distribution ratio cannot be changed by any party it cannot be changed by the rabbul mal and of course it cannot be changed by the mudarib however we observe that islamic banks keep on changing the profit distribution ratio on their profit sharing investment accounts is it true and if it is true is it permissible to answer this question we have to look into the practice of islamic banks very carefully it is it is correct that profit sharing ratio in mudaraba cannot be changed unilaterally however it is allowed to agree on a new profit sharing ratio mutually with mutual consent islamic banks can also change profit ratio with the consent of the profit sharing investment account holders now the question arises what is the consent in this respect and how does it happen now whenever a bank wishes to change the profit distribution ratio which is also commonly known as rate change so whenever it wants to go for a rate change uh, the first step is to have a meeting with the sharia advisory committee or sharia board of the bank so the management the concerned members of the management they have a meeting with the sharia board of the bank and present the case for a rate change if sharia committee is uh, agreeable and they would be agreeable only if it is in compliance with sharia a rate change is uh, proposed this rate change is proposed publicly of course in case of profit sharing investment accounts there are thousands and thousands if not millions of the account holders so it is impossible for a bank to visit the mudaribs in this case the account holders one by one so a public mechanism is used this could be in the form of an announcement on the website of the bank the rate change is announced 
through public notices in the bank branches. It can be in the form of letters, postal letters. It could be in the form of emails. And in some cases, it could be in the form of text messages as well. So once this information is conveyed to the profit sharing investment accounts, this is deemed as offer to change the rate or profit distribution ratio. If the uh, profit sharing investment account holders explicitly accept it, that's fine. However, given that you know, these profit sharing investment account holders are very large in number, it is possible that the bank may not receive the explicit consent of all the profit sharing investment account holders. In that case, in the letter, in the email, or in the text, or whatever be the means of communication, uh, the bank states that no response by date so and so would be deemed acceptance if the profit sharing investment account holder by that time has not already redeemed. What do we mean by redeem? I.e. if the profit sharing investment account holder has not already closed their account. So, uh, it is possible for a bank, Islamic or conventional bank, to change the profit distribution ratio once the account has already been offered and the money has come into it and the bank has started doing business. It is possible only with the mutual consent of the profit sharing investment account holders and we have explained the mechanism for getting the consent of the account holders. If all these requirements are fulfilled, there is no problem for an Islamic or conventional bank to change the profit distribution ratio, which would be deemed as mutually changed profit distribution ratio.